you sent this one to me, Will. This one blew my blew my brains out. <laughs> That's, it's a little extreme. Uh, yeah. It's a, it's a little cool. much. It's like, it's, it's like a, you have mind blowing. Like, this is mind blowing. But uh-huh. you never really stop and think about what you're saying. Yeah. You don't want your mind blown up. What about your socks? Mm. Your socks knocked off. <laughs> yeah. That's also strange. Picture that. <laughs> I don't. I don't want to. You know what other one I saw the other day? Because I'm always trying to. I had to do these titles and stuff. Jaw dropping. Right. But that, it seems less believable. No one's jaws are dropping. <laughs> you know what I mean? Shocking. You sent this to me, and I was like, "Wow, is that real?" I really didn't even think it was real. The McLaren uh-huh. Elva is a roofless, windshieldless supercar. For I don't know who. This yeah. is just a toy for for when? For the weekend, for one day. In, if you happen to live in an area with perfect weather or you're prepared to wear a helmet 24-7 or, you know, what do you have to live in? The desert? You have to live in, in L.A., I guess. It doesn't rain. Mm-hmm. Explain this to me, Will. Well, I would imagine if you're really rich, you have your own kind of neighborhood to drive this around but you want to drive it fast it's a mclaren and you know what happens when you drive fast without a windshield what happens pop 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 the buffeting you know the air you're getting hammered like you're gonna have to wear the helmet is what i'm saying i thought you were talking about bugs bugs too all the above okay but but like look the guy has the helmet are you prepared to wear wear a helmet when you get in your car um no no i i i would be I would like a windshield. You know what? Whatever, though. Because I have to imagine it's a crazy experience. And if you, like you said, Will, if you got two million bucks to blow on a car, it's definitely not your only car. And when you go out in it, you might feel so cool to not have that windshield in between you. Throw your helmet on. Go to the picture that just shows the view out the front. You just passed it. It was in that list there. Is it? Yeah. Look at that. Whoa. Yeah, now, you don't get any uh, window glare, reflection, or anything. It's, it's just crazy. you on the road. What an experience that would be. Right Our on. climate around here would never, I mean. But on a no. nice day, you take it out for a rip. I'll tell you what, you're feeling real cool for a minute. Uh, apparently, a lot of this design is based on the McLaren Senna. Mm. It's very fast. In fact, I think it's even faster. I think it's over $2 million USD or around there at least. Everything is carbon. Look at the way you get into the car. Now, I don't think it's in this photo list. I think you have to go down to the next uh, photo list. Yeah. And check out the first picture there. Look how you get in. You got to hop over. Yeah. It's like a little bucket. Into that tub with the lift up doors. It's got to be one of the craziest cars that's out there. But yeah, I mean... Half the reason you get these cars like this, Will, is so you can look at them. Yes. I mean, you just kind of go look at it. It makes you happy. Mm-hmm. It makes you interested. It's 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 a novel experience just to examine it. The shapes. It's a spaceship. The metal work. So you park it in some sort of nice indoor region. And even on the days you don't feel like driving it, you just, you know... You, you're, you, rather than have your millions sitting elsewhere because you have so many of those millions, here it is manifested in reality. And oftentimes these things go up in value because, you know, they're only going to make around 100, I think, 149. Hmm. So I think that's the play. Collector's item, you know? Yeah.